Hello, my name is Blake, and in this news update, we'll focus on Virgin Hyperloop One. So Virgin Hyperloop One had some big news on April 4th. Richard Branson showed the Crown Prince of Saudi Arabia, His Royal Highness Mohammed bin Salman. They visited Virgin Hyperloop One last year. The company raised $50 million. Now it's making a big push to win contracts to build the first commercial version of the Hyperloop. Dubai is also interested in the Hyperloop with Dubai-based board member Sultan Ahmed bin Salman. So Richard Branson and Chief Executive Officer Sir Rob Lloyd hosted the Saudi Arabia Crown Prince and others in the Mojave Desert at Virgin Galactic. They showed off a repainted Hyperloop pod that is highlighting Saudi Arabia's Vision 2030. The Kingdom of Saudi Arabia's Vision 2030 is a long-term diversification strategy spearheaded by the Crown Prince to bring wide-ranging economic social reforms and modernization to the Kingdom. The King wants to move Saudi Arabia from a technology consumer to a technology innovator and they want to focus on a Hyperloop route between Riyadh and Jeddah, which would take 76 minutes. Currently, it's over 10 hours in driving, and it would utilize for both passenger and freight movement. They also want to focus on Riyadh to Abu Dhabi, which would take about 48 minutes. It currently takes over 8.5 hours to drive. There's also a Saudi talent and internship exchange program Virgin Hyperloop One will host at its innovation campus in California. That's about it. Don't forget to subscribe to In the Hyperloop for further news.